pictures. I'll uh. So you can you can move along then off the police property, please. I'll move along when I'm done with my police no, business. No, you're on police property. You can leave. If you don't have a police problem, you can leave. Okay. I'm just taking some photos, man. I, I know, understand public, this that. is public property. I, I don't it's understand not the problem. Public property. It's police property. Of course, it's public property. Okay. It's not police. It's it's police property. You know, I, I just got a couple more photos to get, and I'll be out of here. So my, I'm doing an investigation of my own, trying to find out what's going on. Am I being detained? You're not being detained right now. I'm so, talking to you. That's so I'm free I'm to go? You're free to walk away. All right, so free to go and free to stay. No, that's not the way it works. You're on what do you property. mean? You're on police property. Our property. Today we got Dunkirk, New York. Out here, and uh, we got the Dunkirk Police Department. Check out some of these police cars and building here. Oh no, I'm all set. I'm just taking a couple pictures. Of the inside of our cars? Yeah. Why? Well, work on a story on some of the police cruisers and getting some pictures, that's all. Pretty clean in there, keeping our cars clean. Slick as slick can be over here. Just taking a couple photos. But what'd you say for what? Uh, just working on a story. A story? Yeah. For who? Oh, I can't tell you that right now. Okay. What's your name? It's an investigation. Okay. Which What's your name? Just working on a story down here. Okay, what's your name? Do I have to answer that question? Well, you're taking pictures of our cars, so I feel like it's a fair trade off. So I have to? You're saying? Well, that or you can move along and not take pictures of our cars. Well, I'm, yeah, I'm just working on a story. When okay. I'm finished taking so, some pictures. I'll. Uh, so you can, you can move along then off the police property, please. I'll move along when I'm done with my police no, business. No, you're on police property. You can leave. If you don't have a police problem, you can leave. Okay. I'm just taking some photos, man. I, you know, I understand public, this that. is public property. I, I don't understand it's not the public problem. Property. It's police property. Of course, it's public property. Okay. It's not police. It's, it's police property. You know, I, I just got a couple more photos to get, and I'll be out of here. Okay. So, if you just help me out and tell me who you are, who you're working for, whatever you're doing, maybe this will go a little better. But this is just a random guy taking pictures of police cars. Is it illegal? I didn't say it was illegal, but it's strange. Oh. Well, so my, I'm doing an investigation of my own, trying to find out what's going on. Am I being detained? You're not being detained right now. I'm so, talking to you. That's so I'm free to go? You're free to walk away. All right, so free to go and free to stay. No, that's not the way it works. You're on property. What do you property. mean? You're on police property. Our property. Police our property. property. No. This is um our property. This is a public the property. Is, these no, are, the ramp is these the are publicly property. owned police cars. Just taking a couple photos. Maybe you get a supervisor down here or something. Nothing wrong with taking photos. It's a First Amendment protected activity right here. You keep saying our, your property. This is our property. This gentleman is just going around taking photos of our cars and I asked him a few simple questions about who he is, why he's doing it, and he's refusing to answer my questions. So Let's I take a couple photos, working on that story. And he's refusing to leave. I can't tell that story. I can't tell that information right now. I'm just working on that story, taking some photographs out here in public. Okay. That's all. He's telling me I gotta leave. I don't. I don't see why I have to leave. It's not illegal for me to be here taking photos. Well, it's not. It's not illegal for us to ask for identification either. No, but I don't have to give it to you. Well, you don't. He's telling me I have to. Or I have to leave. I asked you to leave. Yes. Asked you asked me. We have the right to politely ask you. All to right. Leave. Well. Thanks for asking, but I'm not done taking my photos yet. So I get a couple more around here. 
Thank you. That's all. What are you doing? You don't have to be inside my car. Leave. Are you a sergeant? I am a sergeant. A sergeant? Yes, I am. What do you mean I have to? You, I can't. can't. What is wrong with that? You don't need to be taking photographs of the insides of our cars. Why not? Because. Is that illegal? No, you don't need to be doing seeing what we have on the inside of our cars. You can please you, leave. You guys now. got something to hide in there? Nope. You, hit, you can please leave now, sir. Uh, all right. You're asking me to leave, but I'm, I'm, I'm going to politely decline. I, I respectfully. I'm not doing anything illegal. I'm just taking some photographs you, don't, here. you can take photographs of the outsides of the cars, and then you can leave. You guys got your body cams on? Yes, I do. What's your name? Sergeant Dietzen. Sergeant, you got a badge number or you, ID you, number, you, shield you, number? You, my name is Sergeant Dietzen. Sergeant, you, you, can please leave you got a name and badge There's number here? It's right there. 6'3"? No. 75. Oh, it sure says 6'3". Yeah, it. it's for somebody else. All right. I don't understand what the issue is. I'm just You're taking some photos. Here, that's fine. I'm that's cool. Excuse me. Sir. No, I'm just trying to take some photos. Yeah, here. and you don't you don't have to take photos of the insides of my cars. What What is the issue with it? What is the issue with us? What do you What do you guys got to hide in here? There's something in these cars. I mean, you keep them pretty. You keep our cars pretty clean. That's pretty cool. I like that. Where are you from? Hmm? Thanks for asking. Just a little bit more. Dunkirk, New York, here down here, we got ourselves a police escort. Catch a real picture of this. Get a nice picture of this Dunkirk police badge here. If you don't mind. Thank you. Can I get your name and badge number? Paul. Thank you. What is it, 63 on all you guys' shirts? You got your photos. What, is that, what does that 63 mean? Don't worry about it. It means don't worry about it? Yeah. What do you mean I got all my pictures? There's another cop car coming in. I got more pictures to take. What does that, what does that 63 mean? Don't worry about it. 
It means don't worry about it? Yeah. You guys always treat people like this when they come around taking photos? I just don't see any reason to get my name out. I'm just taking a couple photos. Sarge, go back in. I don't know where he went. Can they get an officer complaint form and a uh, foil request form? Yeah, or sure. foil? What? Just, just hit the buzzer in there. Yeah. Yeah. Can I get a um, officer complaint form and a foil request form? What do you mean you don't have? What would you like to make a complaint with? I'd like an officer complaint form. Not with the supervisor. Alright. You would like to speak with the supervisor? Yeah, I mean, uh, the sergeant was outside a second ago. I don't know if, he, if that's who you're talking about. And it's the sergeant, yes. Yeah, I'd like, I'd like to speak to him. If he can get, grab me one of those FOIL request forms for sure. And uh, I would like one of the officer complaint forms to take home, but if if he's got to talk to me about that, that's fine. Yeah, you can talk to him. I'll give you a FOIA request form, and then you'll have to talk to him about any officer complaints. Thank you. Erie County fam, take a look at this glass that they're behind here. I don't know what's up with this. Is this some kind of intimidation tactic with the glass where you can't see them? I feel like I'm uh, talking to the Wizard of Oz here. The guy, cops probably behind there standing on a milk crate acting bigger than he is or something. I don't get this glass. This one way glass doesn't look very transparent at a police station. Perfect. You know, Sergeant, come out here, out front. Where we... outside. He's outside? Yeah. All right, I'll go talk to him about it. Sergeant, they said I had to talk to you about getting an officer complaint form. Okay. Can I get one? I don't have an officer complaint form. What do you, how do I get an officer complaint form? What do you have a complaint about? I'd like an officer complaint form to take home. We don't have an issue to do that. We what do you mean? Paperwork to do that. You don't have the paperwork we don't to do, do it? That, no. Do you guys have officer complaint forms? No. No, never heard of one. We don't have one. No. You just don't. What, what do you do? Complaint? What do you do if it, if someone has a complaint against they an officer? They tell me what the point is. And then you put it on a form. It's documented. Is it on a specific form though? No. So there's no form. I didn't say there was no form. Do you guys have officer complaint forms? No. No, never heard of one. We don't have one, Because no. I'm going to foil it. Okay. If you don't want to give it to me, that's fine. I don't... What is your complaint? I would like to take an officer complaint from home. That's all I we want. We don't have a form to give you to release home. Why not? Because we don't have that. So a person has to come here, file a complaint with a person in person. There's no other way around that? Yes. There's no officer complaint that. forms available online, nothing like that? No, sir. Hmm. I've, I've seen this system before. It seems a little tilted. Where uh, people are more intimidated to come get a form. Mm -hmm. So the form that you would fill out if somebody filled it out with you, can I get one of those forms? No, we don't have a form to give you, sir. If I had one, I would be more than happy to give it to you, but we do not have one. Well, Erie County fam, as you can see, this is the way they uh, do it down here in Dunkirk, New York. No officer complaint forms available to the public. 
they have um, a FOIL request for them. So, I mean, we will eventually get that document I'm asking for. But uh, that's the Dunkirk Police Department down here. It's very aggressive. Um, follow you around. They, they need to know everything, I guess. Sure, I mean, touching my vehicle. what is the issue with taking pictures inside the vehicle? Yeah, I, well, I want to take some pictures of the insides too. Why not? Those are our vehicles, though. They're not your vehicles. They're our vehicles. Everybody, everybody who pays taxes pays for these vehicles. I mean, I, I bought a stick of gum at the gas station before I came down here. I paid taxes in the city. Are you a property owner in the city? I mean, I, I can't tell you that. But I'm saying these are not. They don't belong to the police department. The police department belongs to the people, and the cars belong to the people. So I have. I, would, I have a complaint about the process. Okay. You could, I'd, I'd love to talk to you about the process if you could tell me why it's a good idea to not have a complaint form available for someone to take home. You could talk to the chief of police about that. We don't have one. Maybe that's something we could look into for it. I mean, it's definitely something that's going to get looked into. And uh, But that form that you would write it on... If I had a formal complaint with you, this that form that you would write it on, you're not willing to divulge one of those to me today? Do you have the form to request that form? I mean, I'll get it. I mean, that's you just, have, you, have, you know what I'm saying? Like, what I'm saying is that the process already looks tilted. All you could do to make it look less tilted is say, you know what, we don't normally do this, but here's the form we use and give a little clarity. That's all I'm looking for. I told you, if I had the form, I would give you the form. But since I don't have the form, I can't give you something I don't have. You can't go inside and print it out? I don't have a form to print out, sir, is what I'm saying. All right. What I'm saying is if you have a formal complaint about one of my officers, you can talk to me about that. But you have yet to specify that. No. You're going to tell me what the 63 means? It's a respect. It's a respect? Yes. Is that one of the officers here or something that Maybe. that fallen? Yeah. Well, I mean, you could say that. I mean, it doesn't. I mean, if it gives the guy respect on the it's right now, that's cool. That's cool. I got no problem with that. Okay. So, are you going to tell me your name so you can file your official? Re re no, I'm just going to file this FOIL request. For, your FOIL for request it. for what, sir? You haven't filed a complaint. You I'm going to FOIL a FOIL request for that body cam. I'm going to FOIL a FOIL request for the officer complaint procedure, okay. the official one. Okay. I'm going to file a FOIL for the for the. Um, actual form that you guys would fill it out on. Okay, but you have yet to file any kind of incident or complaint? No, I don't I don't wish to do that with you right now. So how am I supposed to document what, who you are and what complaint you have against what officer? You got nothing to document right now. Nothing. So then you're not going to, there's nothing there to get besides body cam. I mean, the procedure and the form. Okay. That's all. Okay. I'm just looking for a little clarity out here, that's all. That's fine. So there's no problem with me taking pictures inside the police cars? I don't see, what is the purpose of taking pictures? I'm just asking, it's not illegal, right? And I'm asking you a question, what is the purpose of taking the pictures inside the police car? Because I want to see how, how my car is being treated inside. I want to make sure my tires ain't bald. Mm -hmm. And you did that. You, you have your pictures, you had your videos, sir. Well, I mean, I'm, I don't know if I got all the shots I needed just before I leave, but I just want to make sure it's not illegal and you don't have a problem with me taking a couple photos, that's all. You could take the pictures and leave? I mean, well, I'm not going to stay all night, obviously. Uh, I don't, I'm not going to camp out here. I'm working on a story. Got to get a little information and uh, so are you, be on my way, of course. Of, what type of story are you working on? I can't tell you. It's an investigation at this point. Until I air the story, I can't tell divulge any information because you could you could air the story on me, you know? And you could get all the credit then. Where would I be? All this time I put in getting the right photos and that. But All right, thank you, guys. That's all I needed. Um, I will foil the officer complaint forms and... I'm thinking that an officer complaint form that is available to take home, even if somebody's got to sign it in front of you guys after it's done, I think I think it should be available. I think it should be pretty standard. I think that a lot of people viewing this are going to think twice about like, hey, <laughs> that seems like common sense that it should be that way. But I mean, you're not the only police department and it's not that way, but we're looking to change that. But all right, thank you guys. That's a good suggestion. I appreciate it. Thank you guys.
boosting up security around here a little bit. See if these ladies want to follow me. Boy, they were hot on me, man. They, I thought they were gonna go hands-on for a second there. They're pushing. But that is Dunkirk, New York. 